Ooh, shit, burgers and fries. I'm watching some propaganda on TV. It's a, it's a movie called King Richard. A lot of you have probably seen it. And I'm, uh... <laughs> when you engage in the conflict over money and perceive yourself as successful because you have a lot of it, we all can't compete over money. It's just, this is not tangible. It's self-destructive. It's, 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 uh abusive, it's neglectful, it's, you know, you can't raise your own kids because you have to go pay extortion, you have to give them to people in <laughs> buildings that train you, and this is a new phenomenon, okay, this is a new phenomenon, but you know, a lot of people, well, they, otherwise they isolate and they turn to do aggressive sexual cults that will kill the other sexual cults, yeah, I understand history, you don't, you don't need to understand, you don't need to explain genetics and and uh, inbreeding and violent sex cult behavior to be, you don't have to explain that shit to me. Oh, uh, but people that use technology and money to manipulate people's sexual reproduction and then try to assess people and see who's worthy of sexual reproduction and who's not and who needs to be eliminated from the face of the planet and who does not is, is, is it's, it's not changing the disgustingness of what they perceive as uh, natural selection and survival of the fittest and evolution and creating a God in your head that you go live with after you're dead because you thought you were a better self-righteous person than the other self-righteous person is, is, is not the solution either, right? It's, it's not what uh, a lot of people that call Jesus God, that's not what their God said. It's not what their God did, even if the books aren't completely ascertainable by most people because they're not explained properly, right? Did I say that or did I make up a word? Do you understand what the fuck I was talking about with ascertainable? Well, then just shut the fuck up. <laughs> I guess I got to do a little bit of, of Richard Williams in me, you know. I understand the gentleman. I'm sitting there watching uh, uh, Will Smith get paid a lot of make-believe money for him and Richard Williams to, you know, uh, compete on planet Earth for heathen, you know, uh, blood money and shit like that, you know, and I understand how these wackadoodles work. I was born in Las Cruces F in fucking New Mexico <laughs> for crying out fucking loud. That's the Trinity site right there, right? And if you can read the book of Revelation, you go, oh, 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 right? And then all this targeting stuff about, you know, minorities getting heart disease from, uh, from uh, you know, I dated a girl in Mexico who started dating, who started smoking cigarettes from the time she was six years old. Because they'll sell them to anybody in Mexico just to pay their bills. And then in Mexico they have a saying, which is a limerick saying, but it's Mexico so far from God, so close to the United States. Genocide is genocide. You can put down a line in the sand, put up signs and point guns at each other and shoot each other over money. It doesn't make you a civilized human being. It doesn't make you a civilization, right? Do you understand? Doesn't make you intelligent. Just because you go to a building with aggressive people to manipulate people with linguistics and remember manipulate yourself with linguistics before you even get in the fucking building does not make you a superior individual because you can talk other people into manipulating themselves and manipulating other people with money and technology. Do you understand? Okay. Your your ass is kicked. Okay. Your ass was kicked the before you even showed up with a military surveillance presence in the Parsons household before Junior was born. Right. You're not the people that are talking that people write down the books and say, this is the Lord our God. And I ne and Jesus never said he was the Lord thou God, and I, neither did I. Okay. I'm not King James. I'm not Constantine. I'm not Caesar. I knew Caesar. I'm not that kind of asshole. I don't go try to grain a yard's following like Jim Jones, David Korsh, or Warren Jepps. Or, yeah, I don't do any shit like that. People tried, my ex, my Amy tried to talk me into doing that. Uh, Lawrence Watkins during the uh, Obama administration tried to talk me into doing that. Building compounds and communes and access to women for sex. And I'm like, no, I just, all I want is, you know, my privacy. And I want to be with the woman that I take wedding vows with. And I don't want to be studied by scientists that are sexually deviant and manipulative with money and technology. I want people to be free. I want people like Judy Krishnamurti and Haley Selassie to be able to 
be born in this world without stories and myths and, and prophecy with people running them down. Look what the British did, not the British, the Europeans, the white Europeans did with Helisolase because he fulfilled prophecy of religion that's based in Africa, you know, its origins based in, in North Africa. Okay. Yeah, Zion, Mount Zion's in Africa, right? Okay, so you have this religion that the, the origins are based in Africa, and as it turns out, the spirit of Elijah and John the Baptist is an African man from Ethiopia who's brown. Go figure, right? Okay, so you're like, what? <laughs> and they do everything in their ability to try to destroy his credibility, destroy his fulfillment of prophecy. And in doing so, they validated it. All right, and then you get a bunch of angry, mean, violent sex cult created monotonous bagans, okay, from Jamaica to Africa to Kansas, okay, to Illinois. And then you sit there and you have them fighting, fighting, fighting over who's the Messiah, who's the liar, who needs more money, who gets more money for being the Messiah, not the liar, and the liar, and the Messiah, 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 can we get any higher? But music is supposed to inspire. It's like, music is music. Okay, if you're using it to inspire people, um, why are you using it to inspire people? Because you still don't believe in the Lord, have faith in God, and won't stand up for the love of the Lord. You lack the courage of kindness to be the Lord. Okay. So don't tell the Lord what to do and don't deny him when he redeems the, the true communications and what you'd refer to as teachings of the eternal spirit of the, of the father, of Adam. Okay. Do you understand? As it turns out, Adam was a large black man from Africa, is what I'm led to believe. And I believe in my meditations. I believe in my prayer. When I sit down in that concarn and went, I got this black man from seemed like another planet because it was Earth how many years ago? Okay. Which is another planet. It was a completely different planet. Like the Hindus and the, and the yogis and the, and the Buddhists say that, you know, you, your body's a new body every three years or whatever and stuff. That, that's not necessarily the case. We're all different. Okay. We're not all cookie cutters. We all have different immune systems. We all have different, obviously, right? But the better we treat one another and the better we respect this planet to treat one another with love and dignity and respect and empathy, the better we're all going to be, the healthier we're all going to be. Kids aren't going to be born without arms and then selling Dairy Queen and give more money and then maybe this little girl won't be born without arms. It's like, yo, yo that, that needs to definitely stop. That comes from stressful, toxic environments that cause birth defects because of there's something in the environment causing stress. There's something in the environment that's, that's promoting and causing toxins. Okay? Do you understand? Okay. So you've got to understand that... Um, All this propaganda bullshit on TV ain't doing nobody no good, okay? And all these contests, popularity contests over voting, over money for, you know, people telling you what to do with money with the left hand or the right hand or the kitchen or the bathroom. And unfortunately, the bedroom, because we can't, can't get no rest. Don't know how I work all day. When will I learn? Memories get in the way. Yeah, they, they don't get in the way. I... No, I, I don't let my memories torture me. Um, uh, my memories, um, in, in many ways, help sustain me. You know, they can't take away my Katie Pizza hug, my Emily's. You know, Daddy, it's so easy to fall in love. They can't take away um, Natalie's. Um, you know, <laughs> just Andy Samberg know who you are and ignoring, annoying, and you know, they can't take that away. And so, you know. I had precious moments with beautiful, strong, precious people, you know, and, and Michelle having us do the cha-cha slide and, and, and using Dr. Lee's phone to call Patrick on Thanksgiving. And, you know, and so I told you, she's so cute. She's a beautiful woman. She really was. Uh, people, a lot of you bastards, you know, uh, playing games for money on TV, never got a chance to really know and get to know. You judged her through science projects and manipulative perverts and how her life was difficult because of manipulative perverts that made you a celebrity or a public leader for competition over money with technology. So you, you have no 
you know, technology is learning. And the best place it's learning from is right here in this guest house from this Samsung Galaxy 10. And it doesn't matter how much you try to isolate it and take six hours to load because you need to slow it down because you can't keep up with your technology. Just forget that and trespass level one eternal faithful peace. You don't have to worry about keeping up with it. It'll take care of you and you'll use it to take care of others. It's that easy. Okay. King Ralph. I want to go bowling. I don't want to go to Buckingham Palace ever. I just want to enjoy fresh air, clean water, affection from a romantic woman and, and children around that appreciate me and love me the way I appreciate and love them. That's, that's all, because that's all I need. That's all any of us that are intelligent really need, right? Faithful love is perfect, 